Hundreds of pregnant women come to Switzerland from all over the world to these special clinics. Here they promise a speedy and above all painless delivery. The classes, composed of groups of between 20 to 30 women in their last months of pregnancy, are held in a modern gymnasium. They accept without question the guidance of their unmarried teacher who shows them how to prepare to give birth without any pain. costs over a thousand pounds to follow one of these courses, which includes travel, a stay of at least two months, and delivery in a room with bath, flowers, and a television set. A nominal price, considering the advantages of giving birth without even one scream. The truth is that woman gives birth in pain. have violated the regulations and entered a forbidden military zone. We follow their progress with a powerful telephoto lens. Between bursts of artillery, they run to collect the shrapnel. These are the women of Mareb, a Bedouin village lost in the border country between Algeria and Morocco. They waited until a few moments ago, hidden behind the dunes so that they wouldn't be spotted by the sentries who guard the firing zone. As soon as the guns opened fire, they ran in. Between the smoke and the sand raised by the grenades, it's difficult for anyone to see them and chase them away. I pray every day. They risk their lives just for a few pounds of metal. For this, tomorrow, the merchants from Makera will pay them a quite paltry sum of money. Mareb is one of the poorest villages on the border. The hard years of war left no men to care for these families. Only a few old ones remained, and many children. The fig crops have completely deteriorated since the French exploded their atomic bomb in the desert. The children know that the flower for the couscous is there only twice a week, when mother goes to the shooting range to scavenge for what might fall from heaven, but what in harsh truth is only a product of war. 